everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ask Amber and today I'm going to be showing you how to add music to an emote on your avatar. The only downside to this is that you cannot add music to emotes for quest avatars. So this is going to be for PC only. So let's get started. Before anything else, make sure you hop over to my website and download animations with music files from my downloads. This has a bunch of different files that you can use and once you have those downloaded, you're all set to go. The first thing you're going to want to do is make sure that your overrides that's attached to your model has all of the animations that you want to use in the emotes that you're going to link music to. So make sure that all of your emotes are set up before you start adding audio. I actually have more videos on how to do this, so if you're confused up to this point, just go back to my channel and look at my other animation videos. Next you're going to want to toggle down your armature, right click on hips, go to audio, and audio source. And that will add an audio source that's connected to your hips, so it will move where you move. I'm going to rename this audio source to be follow the leader, which is the name of the emote and the audio file that I will be using. Then I'm going to navigate to the folder where my audio file is and I'm going to drag it up into the audio clip section. Now to be totally honest, I don't know everything about audio, I just know the few things that I do. I turn my priority all the way to the left and then I change my max distance of sound to 20 because I don't like people really really far away from me hearing it too loudly. Once that's done, I'm going to go ahead and duplicate my model like I've explained in previous videos and I'm going to hide my main model and work on my second model. With the duplicate model selected, I'm going to go ahead and click on the animations tab. I'm going to click the drop down and I'm going to choose follow the leader from the list of options. If for some reason your drop down doesn't have the emote you're looking for, that just means that you haven't applied it to your avatar yet. So go back and apply it to your avatar, make another duplicate and then come back. Once you click on that, you're going to see a ton of keyframes come up. Don't touch any of these. This is how your model is animated. All you have to do is click add property, toggle down your armature, toggle down your hips, and then scroll down to where you see your follow the leader animation. Toggle that open and just click the plus icon. Make sure that game object is active is checked and then go back to your project. Then just reactivate your original model and delete the duplicate. The last step is to find your audio source in your main model and just uncheck it. That means that it won't be playing unless your animation is going. And that is literally it. Just upload your model and check it out in VRChat, play those emotes, and dance the night away. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one.